you all tuckered out from that? <laughs> Good morning. We're so happy that you're here. We daily vlog, so if you like this video, come back tomorrow. Me and Eva are out and about early. We just finished up at the vet. She has had a little bit of fogginess in her eyes that we've noticed. And we just needed to get it checked out, right? Um, thankfully, light shone through, no signs of cataracts, no signs of vision, like, impairedness. Her vision is not impaired at all. She hasn't been acting different. So it's just something that we're gonna keep an eye on, but wanted to get checked out as early as possible. She was like literally like crawling off of my shoulder in the room. Um, so I'm carrying her home. And that is a relief. Look at this big kid playing with toys. In his seat while I edit. The camera died. I have to find a battery. I don't, we're like not in the swing of using the G7X just yet. Like before when we would use it, we would like, Peter would charge it every night. It would live in one spot, but with a toddler who's very intrigued by a small little camera, I feel like the M50 was like, he like it was less like oh I want to play with this like it wasn't I don't know like I just feel like this camera's like smaller and like more he's more intrigued by it we kind of have to like keep it out of reach um and so yeah I had it because I'm editing and the battery's not charged so we got to get better with that um but this is a face of a mom who <laughs> napped when her children napped um James is actually still napping now which is great, it's longer than he usually naps. Um, but it's officially September 1st, and so our no spend August is over. And for the longest time, I've had a hankering for Olive Garden. Don't ask me why, probably their breadsticks. I didn't want to ever do like a pickup order because I want unlimited breadsticks. And I know they give you them when you pick up an order, but it's not. You, you have to stop when they, when you run out of how many ever they packed. So I asked Peter like a week ago, I was like, can our first restaurant <laughs> that we go out to eat to be Olive Garden? Um, so we can just itch this scratch and enjoy it. And it works out because we do need to go grocery shopping. I don't have a plan for dinner. So we're going to go to Olive Garden tonight. And my level of excitement is very high. <laughs> We're not going to Olive Garden. <laughs> <laughs> but we pinky promised. This weekend. And we don't break pinky promises in our in this friendship and marriage. No. Teddy just has been having a trying day. I feel like that's our word. Trying. I don't want to do that to him. Like if he's not feeling up for it, why should we force him to go to a restaurant? Yeah. And so we're gonna get dinner nearby. We're taking a nice walk. Stroll. And also I didn't realize that our Olive Garden, like the closest one, which feels close because it's like where we get off on the highway, it's a 30 minute drive right now. I also think it would be more. Because it's like a lot of just like stoplights and the time of day. School letting out, So highway work. Who knows if that's like the one we'll go to over weekend. I don't know. It just seemed better not to. I really had my heart set on it, but I'm all right. We're gonna get pop <laughs> They have a pumpkin spice milkshake. I don't think we're gonna get it. I'm just like, I haven't had any pop today, so I'm gonna get that fountain drink and refill it as much as I can. <laughs> That's my goal. But that looks yummy. I love, I love the cookie on top. That's that's the best part. Do you think baked chips are icky like your mom does? so jazzed about this. This is a good consolation prize. Peter got a big Italian that looks so good. What do you see? I think I got the pizza melt. Yeah, with hot peppers on it. Mmm, so good. Oh, and I also got a broccoli soup. 
Why is Teddy staring at me like that? Hello. Are you okay over there? How's your stuff? I'm eating it too fast and it's very spicy. James just keeps clapping and yelping in excitement. It barks like things on this. You're all done? Good signing. Well, that was delicious. Hot Belly never dis disappoints. Have you ever had a disappointing Hot Belly? Yeah, that one time. Just kidding. <laughs> it never disappoints. We're gonna go to a park over here now. I am so full. So am I. I don't oh, look at those balconies. I would, I would do anything for a balcony like that. Yeah, I would. I would. Show the rainforest. <laughs> um, this is the cutest thing I ever saw. What are you guys doing? I just miss James going on the slide by himself on his stomach. Maybe he'll do it again. Are you, are you gonna go down the sli slide? Yay! If you punched your belly out, you would have gone down more fast. Go! <laughs> Here we go, round three. Let's go, James. You got it, Mama? You doing alright? Is your Peloton workout for the day? We both gotta exercise later. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Oh gosh. Wow, are you driving? Beep beep. Alrighty, we went to Target. Got some celebratory San Pellegrino, some wine, um, and what else in there? Cleaning pods and breakfast bar for Peter. Not for Peter, for James. And this child has succumbed to a nap. <laughs> Look at it, you can see his belly. Hocus Pocus Halloween bash. What? 
starring Ginger Minch from Hocus Pocus 2. That's really cool. Featuring Gidget Galore. At the Cabaret Theater. Wanna go? Yeah. Guess what's next weekend? Well, this is going on at Sidetrack this weekend. So fun. And look at this. Look at this truck. Wow. Okay. All right, James went down. Sarah just got the vlog live. Um, don't you guys hate if this ever happens to you when somebody you watch on YouTube all the time, you're like, wow, they didn't post a video in a while. They didn't post a video in a while. And then you go to search your channel and you realize that two videos have come out in the past three weeks and somehow you didn't catch that. Especially when they're like 35 minute videos. That's great. But also, why didn't I see it? Trout and Coffee, which we watch on YouTube, that's what happened to us. For days now, I've been, I've been telling Sarah, like, what's going on? Like, he hasn't posted in so long. And finally, I went to his, I was like, today, giving James a bath, and I was like, maybe somehow, by chance, accidentally, we got unsubscribed. So I went to his channel. We're still subscribed, but there was two videos that I didn't see get posted. So, clean up the toys while Sarah's getting the vlog up, watching the Trout and Coffee, and our Amazon boxing. Here we go. Just a couple of little things we ordered. I think. Jelly Cat Bashful Security Blanket. It's jelly cat. It's a lovey. It's a lovey? Oh. So soft. Jelly Cat. London. Ooh. Happy Thanksgiving Ball Wreath Series. Six parts, motors and sensors, car racetrack racer. Nice. Let's see if this thing needs. Uh, it's a small version of what he loves at Christmas. Yeah. Let's see if he, this needs assembly. Oh yeah. Christmas on. Oh. Even though. It's 10.45, we have to be still more productive tonight. Sarah's gonna edit another vlog. I'm gonna fold laundry. Yeah. So, lights are going on, just some of them, because we have a sleeping baby. I'm gonna plug in these lights, and this light, and then so I can fold laundry. In some light, but not disturbing the baby. And I, like, stretched up this, so I'm gonna go hang this. Good. Looks good. I'm not going anywhere, Eve, don't worry. I realized as I was hanging that, trying to vlog it, trying to be hip and cool, that our address is right in the center of that. So I couldn't authentically just hang it for you. Because then you'd know an address. It's totally the next morning. Teddy is kicking the camera. He's loving his lovey. And it's good to be home. <laughs> we know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.